Hello and welcome to Bernadette TV, online TV to help you be the best you can be in your business and your life. And this week we have a question from Anne-Marie who writes, Hi Bernadette, I'm just starting out, I don't have any success stories and I don't feel I can claim expertise when I don't have a track record. How can I get clients when I have no track record? Anne-Marie, that's a great question and I want to remind you that everybody starts out in the same situation, including me. When you're starting out, of course, you don't have the client success stories because you are just starting out. But you need to remember that this is a challenge to be overcome, not a reason to never get started. The next thing I want to remind you of is that expertise does not get awarded like rosettes. It's something that you claim. So when I was starting out, I really wanted to specialize on sales training using NLP, that's Neuro Linguistic Programming Techniques. That's where my passion was, that's where my interest was. And yet it quickly became apparent to me that that's not where the marketplace was and there wasn't a lot of demand for it. But I did have people asking me for help with setting appointments by phone and cold calling. So I was able to adapt what I was interested in and map it over to that specific area and before too long I had clients and more than that I could credibly call myself an expert in that thing because it was a unique and specific area that I was focusing on. So don't wait for anybody to come out and hand out the rosette. You need to claim a certain area of expertise and you can do that just with a decision, just by deciding to focus on a specific area. The third thing I want to say to you is to focus on your warm contacts. A big mistake that people make when they're starting out is they think they have to go and drum up business from a totally cold audience. And this is a big mistake because people who don't know, like or trust you, they're going to be the most skeptical. They're going to be the hardest convinced to spend money with you. It is far better to focus on your warm contacts people who know you, people who will recommend you and refer you and be happy to give you a helping hand even if you're just starting out. So focus on those people. And finally, you do what you can with what you've got where you are and collect the testimonials, success stories and case studies as you go. If you commit to this before too long, you'll have a nice collection of testimonials that you can share with prospective clients and more importantly, that inner belief and confidence that get, comes from doing the work. Not because someone's awarded it to us, it can only come from the inside. So there you go, Anne-Marie. I hope that's helped you. And I just want to give you lots of encouragement and remind you that, yes, it might feel tough when you're starting out, but it's definitely worth it and it's certainly not impossible. I'd love to hear how you get on with this tip. So please come on over to my blog, BernadetteDoyle.com, and let me know how this impacted you. And if you want more like this, please hit this big button here, the subscribe button, because then when you do, YouTube will automatically update you when I release a new episode. We do so every Thursday. But I don't want to stop there. I want to give you more. And in fact, if you are in a similar situation to Anne-Marie, I would really love you to check out my step-by-step -step program, because it's a program that I've designed to take you step-by-step -step from starting out and then doing the right things in the right order to build your confidence and build your business and I would love to see you as part of it. So if you come on over to BernadetteDoyle.com, sign up for my email updates and you'll automatically get a special video letting you know all about that program. That's it from me, and I can't wait to hear more from you, and I look forward to seeing you on the next episode of Bernadette TV. I have no track record. Oh, oh yes you do. Oh no I don't. Oh yes you do. Oh no I don't. Oh yes you do. All right then I do. <laughs>